Centurion is the most famous and certainly the most fought British tank of the second half of the XX century. The tank was created at the end of World War II as part of a program with the unofficial name, British Tiger. However, the British did not succeed in making the Tiger, but nevertheless they did make the British Panther, which, in general, was not bad either. The peculiarity of the Centurion tank fleet is that the early tanks were constantly modernized to the level of later modifications. The basis of most of them is the Centurion MK3 modification, the most mass-produced one. The Centurion was designed according to the classic layout scheme with the aft location of the engine and transmission compartment. In the front of the MK3 hull, the right side of the tank is the control compartment, which accommodates the driver, and on the left side are ammunition, a storage box and a drinking water tank. There is a driver's hatch in the roof of the control compartment, with two periscopic observation devices in the covers. The gunner and tank commander are located to the right of the gun, and the loader to the left of the gun. On the right side of the turret roof is the commander's turret with a hatch, the perimeter of which is fitted with bevel triplex blocks. A periscope is installed in the turret roof. To the left of the commander's turret is the loader's hatch. The gunner uses a periscopic sighting device to observe the terrain. The gunner has a periscopic sight. The tank turret is fitted with an 83.8mm pounder rifled cannon with a muzzle velocity of armor-piercing projectile of 1,020 meters per second and subcaliber projectile of 1,325 meters per second. The gun is paired with a machine gun. A 7.92mm machine gun is paired with the gun. The tank gun was designed without a muzzle brake. The tank is not fitted with an anti-aircraft machine gun. The accuracy of firing from the tank on the move is ensured by the installation of the armament stabilizer in two guidance planes. The vertical angles of guidance of the tank gun are, elevation angle plus 20 degrees and declination angle minus 10 degrees. The vertical and horizontal gun pointing mechanisms are electrically driven. The ammunition capacity is 65 rounds for the gun and 3,600 rounds for the machine gun. The tank is powered by a 12-cylinder liquid-cooled Meteor gasoline engine developing up to 650 horsepower at 2,550 rpm. The gasoline tanks are located inside the hull on both sides of the power compartment. To the left of the main engine is an auxiliary engine of 8 horsepower, which drives a generator used to supply electrical power to consumers and to charge the batteries when the main engine is stopped. The Centurions received their baptism of fire during the Korean War. 45 MK3 tanks of the 8th His Majesty's own Royal Irish Hussars Regiment took part in combat operations. Later on, tanks of this type were used in the British Army only in the Middle East. For example, on November 5th, 1956, Centurion MK5 tanks of the 6th Royal Tank Regiment landed in Port Said as part of the Anglo-French grouping. At the turn of the 1960s, Centurions were used by British forces in police and counter-guerrilla operations in the Southern Arabian Peninsula. Since 1967, they began to be removed from the British Army and replaced by the main battle tanks, Chifton. The last war in which the British Centurions were involved was the Gulf War. In Operation Desert Storm, ABRE demoning tanks and MK-2 ARVs of the Royal Engineers Corps and barbs of the Royal Marines were used. <laughs>